Researchers just made a shocking discovery in Georgia sewer water, and it's one of the top 10 global public health threats facing humanity today. Take a look. A scientific first as researchers discover a gene that could cause critical antibiotics to stop working. The MCR9 gene was found in Georgia sewer water from an urban setting. The presence of this gene is a serious public health concern because it causes bacteria to be resistant to one of the world's most important antibiotics, colistin. Even more, researchers found evidence of the gene in the first sample they tested, signaling that the gene is becoming more prominent in the U.S. Fear and concern are mounting following this recent discovery. So what can be done to tackle this global public health threat? University of Georgia Assistant Professor Ismat Kasem and infectious disease expert Dr. Monica Gandhi join us today. Welcome to the two of you. Welcome. I had not heard about this. So Ismat, how did you and your team make these findings? Uh, we have been working on uh, MCR9 genes for nonstop for more than five years now. Um, a few years back, we predicted that we're going to find the MCR gene in the U.S. Recently, we were screening sewage samples, and unfortunately, we found it. Explain to us why this is so concerning, this mutation of this particular gene. Well, the MCR genes, they encode resistance. They make the bacteria resistant to an antibiotic called colistin. And colistin is a last resort antibiotic which is used to treat complicated infections, infections with multi-drug resistant bacteria. These are normally complicated infections that can lead to severe uh, problems in patients. So the MCR gene will make colistin ineffective in, in treatment uh, of a human infections. Dr. Gandhi, but this stuff is scary. So what concerns you most about these findings from your infectious disease perspective? Well, this is concerning because antimicrobial drug resistance in bacteria could be the third leading cause of death in the, in the world. What it means is that um, we, have, we can run out of antibiotics to treat bacteria. And in this case, the specific um, plasmid or a gene, it basically confers resistance in the bacteria to almost everything that we'd ever use for what are called gram-negative organisms, including this colistin, which is kind of a last resort agent for treating uh, gram-negative bacteria. So yeah, this, this, was, this made me really worried.